Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video, guys. To any of you that have a Volkswagen Tiguan, guys, first generation, I'm talking about year 2007 to year 2017, and you're trying to find the fuses, guys, for the engine computer, engine management system, guys, and, and some of those fuses will control fuel injectors, they will control, guys, ignition coils, they will control the engine computer and uh, uh, normal operation of the engine. So if one of those fuses doesn't work, your car may not start, guys, and as a result, Will, uh, you will need to replace that fuse. Now, in some cases, probably there is a reason what causes a fuse to go bad. Sometimes they just burn, but often, guys, uh, bad uh, connection somewhere, uh, bad fuel injector, ignition coil sometimes can burn a fuse as well. So, there are many fuses. Make sure you stay until the end. Some of them are hidden, actually. And before we start, guys, okay, let me tell you something. If you need to buy fuses, relays, parts, anything like that, we'll put the links in the description of the video below, and you can see where we get all our tools and parts from guys for a really good price S uh, something else guys every single car we get at the shop we make at least 200 free repair videos and why we do that because our mission here at the shop is to save you as much money as we can all we need guys in return please subscribe to the channel and like the video that way we can keep providing this free information first we're going to start with opening the hood that's that's where some of the fuses will be located but not all of them so make sure guys okay you stay until the end so you can see what i'm talking about so this is guys your fuse box okay right here go ahead open it how slide forward these two locks grab it pull it out now on the back side you don't have anything that tells you about the fuses so you need to be extremely guys okay familiar with your system now right here guys you start the fuse numbers by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Then you go 10, 11, 12, 13. Uh, the big fuses are a little bit uh, mismatched. For instance, you go to number 25, 26, then uh, 20. Okay, this one will be 27, 28, 29, and 30. So you always have to make sure you get the, the right fuses. Now, guys, some of you, I know, you think you know how to recognize if a fuse is burnt. You pull the fuse, okay. And when you pull that fuse, you actually check, okay, if it's burned or not, correct? But in some cases, you cannot tell for sure. And we'll put a link to a video that explains how to test your fuse in just a few seconds. So you will know for sure if it's good or bad. Because a bad fuse, guys, that you think it's good, okay, will, uh, will make your wife really hard. Because you'll start putting money or replace parts when you, all you had to do just, guys, replace a fuse that seemed okay but actually was burned. So the first fuse that we need to check guys fuse number 10 this fuse right here 10 amp fuse guys in some cases it could be a 5 amp fuse this is for the engine control module then you're going to go to fuse number guys 13 1 2 okay 11 12 13 another 10 amp fuse guys okay right here in some cases you may have a 15 or a 30 amp fuse depending on the configuration and all that stuff so far fuse number 10 fuse number 13 some of you will have fuse number 14 as well fuse number 14 okay right here then you will need to check guys fuse number 15 as well fuse number 15 is uh, very important for the fuel pump and the engine management system as well and uh, fuse number 15 will be this fuse okay right here it could be 5 amp 10 amp or 15 amp fuse so these fuses guys are so far but you have more uh, another fuse guys that controls the engine computer and the engine management is fuse number 20 okay and fuse number 20 will be this 5 amp fuse right here then you have fuse number 21 we don't have this one some of you will do though and fuse number 23 okay fuse number 23 so let me actually see where is that fuse number 23 okay right here 10 amp fuse this one is for the engine management system too but then you need to go inside your car guys and you have three more fuses that you need to check so let me explain where they're located quick uh, there guys okay when you open the door it's under the storage compartment we have a special video that explains how to access all that and how to get to it so check it out it will be on the channel guys and it will explain actually all that so let me now okay tell you guys okay fuses that we need to check fuse number 13 okay will be this fuse okay right here let me focus quick okay perfect so we have fuse number okay one two three four five the fifth fuse from left to right even if you're missing one you count 
13, 14 and 15. These three fuses are for the engine management system as well. So if your car doesn't start, check all these fuses guys and make sure everything checks out fine. Hopefully guys the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.